Hi, my name is Henrietta. I just graduated from a bachelor's in biological sciences at Durham University. And next week, I'm starting a one year master's of research course in molecular plant and microbial sciences at Imperial College London, with support from the British Society for Plant Pathology. I applied to take the molecular plant and microbial sciences course as I have a really strong interest in food security. I'm particularly pleased to have secured a place on this course at Imperial College London, as one of the specialities of this course is that it contains not one but two research projects, which I hope will allow me to gain a wide range of practical lab skills to support my development as a plant pathologist. I actually attended the Gatsby Undergraduate Plant Science Summer School in 2019, which is a bit of a seminal moment for me with regards to piquing my interest in plant pathology. At the summer school, there was a practical task in which we conducted surveys about ash tree dieback in the local area, providing me with a first-hand insight into the extent to which a single pathogen can decimate a plant population, really highlighting to me the impact plant pathogens have on agricultural communities. Following the Gatsby summer school, I enrolled in a third year module called Crops for the Future, and I thoroughly enjoyed studying plant immunity and how pathogens can evade that immunity. My course induction is due to start next week and the first research project will commence soon after. I'm really looking forward to the course starting and I'm excited to meet my supervisors and undertake my first lab-based research project. My Masters of Research will be made up of two independent six-month research projects centering on plant pathology. Personally, I have a strong interest in maintaining food security, so I'd like to focus at least one of my projects on a pathology affecting an agriculturally cultivated species, such as tomato or wheat. Given my undergrad dissertation was moved online, I'm really hoping this course will allow me to learn some practical lab skills relevant to plant pathology, including qPCR to study expression of genes during and after a pathogen attack, and aseptic techniques for working with pathogens. I also find genetics and genomics really fascinating, so I'm hoping to learn how to use techniques such as agrobacterial transformation and gene silencing to study effects of pathogen resistance genes in crops.